What's up guys, Terminal here. Welcome back to another video of Grand Theft Auto 4. So, um, when I just hopped on this game, Roman just just called me saying that uh, I should probably pick him up to go spend time with him. And... My one and only cousin, except for the other ones. Let's go. Nico, you do not know how great it is to have you here with me. Before you arrived in Liberty City, things were terrible. I still remember the emails you sent me, cousin. You should have told me how bad things were in this country before I got here. Okay, things aren't easy for us here, but together, we are doing all right. America is an opportunity for a new beginning. You are in need of one. There is no such thing as a new beginning, Roman. With every day we live, we pick up new baggage. Baggage that we must carry with us for the rest of our lives. There's no dropping into pretending we are fresh and clean just because we get off a boat in a new place. Stop being so dramatic, Nico. Time is a healer. We live and we forget the past. Nothing helps a man forget, like right around American titties. You have to move on from the things that happened to you and think about all the opportunities in this country. Chances to make lots of money. Chances to get college girls and too bad. Sean said it. Shit. I hope to God that Vlad isn't here. I don't know who that is. But yeah, um, I just received a call from Roman and this dude was out here. Scumbag in that place. Yeah, so anyways, yeah, I, I just got I just got a call from Roman talking about um See the way that man was looking at me? Ma'am, y'all are him? drunk as hell. <sighs> anyways. Fuck you! Fuck you, Nickelbelly! Um, yeah, so Roman basically like called me talking about nobody. how I should take him to a bar or whatever, somebody. and this is the result. So, so what if I, moved here? I don't know why I decided to pick it, pick it up if I knew it was going to happen. I don't really do much of the, the activities on Grand Theft Auto like that, unless it's like required for completion. And you'll learn a lot about games of chance, about hard work and opportunity, about... What is this? Roman? Roman, what are you doing? Um, uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I just completely, I damn near forgot what I was about to say. Um, I was, so what I was trying to say is that, you know, I've been, I've been liking Grand Theft Auto 4 so far. Um, if it's an old game that came out nearly probably, wow, 14 years ago. I think this game came out like 2008, I think. Man, so many things happened back in 2008. Like, I'm trying to remember what, what came out and what was so big back in the day. But I remember how Grand Theft Auto 4 was like so big back in the day. It's like... And I think a friend of mine recommended this game to me because it's like the best written GTA 4, like the best one in terms of story. Probably gameplay features wise, GTA 5 is probably the best. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I still need to get a little, I still need to get used to a bit of the controls. Maybe we'll get to that much later, but anyways. Um, hey, five likes and then I'll do another video of Grand Theft Auto 4. Oh wait, let, let's head on to the story mission. Easy fare. See what this is up to. Come on, Hattie. Forget about the fat, sir. Vlad's shots up. Right? But this is weird. And you're a countess. Uh, talking about serfs. Oh, hey, Nico. Where's Rome? <laughs> Good question. Hey, Yoko, your dumb cousin isn't here. Go get me a coffee. What? Get me a fucking coffee! Don't listen to him, Nico. Come on, I'll get you one. What? You keep staring at me. I'll burst one of your eyeballs. Gorgeous. This guy's a fucking creep. Give him a break. He's no one. Man, the speak for yourself. I can see that. Did you walk here from 1985? Bro, Vlad is so weird. Yeah. Excellent. Now stop fucking staring at me. I mean, I know I'm good looking and everything, but come on. Whoa. What, what was that supposed to mean? Uh, hey, Mallory. Hey, man. <laughs> Where did About Roman time. come from? Vlad, Vladdy boy, what's going on? Roman, Roman boy, you tell me what's going on. Ooh. Nice aftershave, what is that? Sex pest? No, <laughs> it's where is my fucking money? I, I had it, I, I had some of it. Then those Albanians you said you would deal with came and smashed my computer. <laughs> so it's my fault? I, I didn't say that. Good. Anyway, Nico dealt with him. 
Brooke Dalton's arm. Then we dub a couple more. Man, why are you then snitching, Roman? <laughs> Is that so? I tell you what. While you don't pay, maybe you and Nico can do me few favors. Sure. <laughs> Good. Why not? Later, Vlad. What? The phone's ringing. Hey. Yeah. Okay. No, I, I can't do it. My cousin will do it. Yes, he can drive. No, he's not a cop. His name is Nico. You'll be right over. Nico. Sorry to ask, cousin. Can you go pick up Jermaine, one of my regulars? He's over on Rotterdam Hill on Mohawk Avenue? Whatever. What is all about? I am not feeling Roman right now. I to get him a fucking coffee, and Nico didn't want to. Coffee? What was he thinking? I know. Man, I am not feeling Roman. This dude was out here. We, we just sent him with a bar or whatever. We just took him to a bar, and now all of a sudden he wanted to disappear for that one couple second. Where was he at, bro? Oh, oh my gosh. Anyways, let, let, let's just, let's go pick up. Bro, am I going to? Is that the docks, bro? I'm not. I'm going the wrong way. Uh, so basically, what I'm so what I'm seeing right now, so far, is that Nico just came to America via in Liberty City, and. Because his co cousin was talking about how he was living a life, right? And this dude was straight up lying to him. This dude, this dude isn't living with no condos, with, with no l ladies or nothing. Like he, he's just out here in the middle of New York, just living, living in, in the worst places ever. But who knows? Maybe, maybe I'll switch around as soon as we progress through the story. Fucking. All right, let's go pick up this guy. Oh my God! No, no, no! Thanks for coming. Can you take me over to Masterson Street? Masterson Street it is, Jermaine. I got you. Yeah, so the handling of the vehicles is a, Shit, is a lot more Roman heavier than GTA 5. I need someone I can trust for this run. I'm Roman's cousin. If you can trust him, you can trust me. Ah, uh, he told me about you. You're Nico, right? The hotshot ladies' man cruising around the Mediterranean, breaking hearts and making millions? Yeah, I traded in the yacht for this cab. <laughs> That's exactly the kind of bullshit I can imagine Roman making up. You've got to give him credit for his imagination. Yeah, you got him. I had a feeling you sounded too good to be true. The question is... Are you willing to get your hands dirty? My hands haven't been clean for a long time. Being here in Liberty City is just making them dirtier. Okay, okay. I gotta pick up some hot parts for my locker. You down? I ain't got no problem with that. Just don't tell me if you stole this shit from a hospital or a school for sick kids. My conscience is troubled enough already. Interesting. So, I guess since Roman Rever can't can't uh, pay the pay the rents or or like the debt money, whatever. Looks like Nico has to resort to crime. Typical of GTA, but maybe this is like a really that different door approach. Isn't meant to be open. Wait here while I take a look. The cops are on to me. Get us out of here. Uh oh. I ain't going down, man. Bro, I, I heard the cop. Oh my gosh, bro, we, bro, we gotta run. I heard the cops in GTA 4 are like way harder to escape from than GTA 5. Get it out, man. Get these cops off our tails. I mean, so far, it, it doesn't seem that bad. I mean, it's just getting out of their range or whatever, right? Yes, yeah, leaving the zone, so it, it's, it doesn't seem that bad. I don't, I don't know why people think it's like harder compared to GTA 5 because it's like, because GTA 5 is more like you have to, you kind of right. have to. I don't think they know where we are. Don't attract any unnecessary attention. Damn, are they, are they coming this way? I swear to God. I... Damn it, dude! They're, they're coming this way. I right, better. Oh, shit. 
but we get it. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was so close right there. I thought I thought we were gonna get caught again. They're gone. Thanks. Nice. Yeah. So GTA Five, it's like I don't I don't know what kind of determines. So what brings you to Liberty City, Nico? Roman, I guess, and some other things. I'm looking for something. Good luck finding them. How's the hunt been going so far? It has not really started yet. I'm getting settled in, you know? Roman has had some issues with loan sharks that needed to be resolved. There's this asshole called Vlad, who he owes money to as well. Good luck with that. So yeah, um, I don't know, I, I don't exactly remember how, what kind of determines that the fact that you you're about to escape from the cops in GTA 5 because it's like if you're like in the zone river like the whole screen flashes red and there's like no area which suggests that they're gonna they're gonna leave you alone or whatever right but GTA 4 is just leaving out of a zone so I don't know why some people think it's like harder to escape in GTA 4 compared to GTA 5 because it, it's not that bad so far all right, enough talking. Let's go bring our guy, Jermaine. Okay, we're here. Thanks, man. Back Keep to looking his place. after Roman, all right? Pay and spray. I'm no stranger to that. How much? How much? Oh, is, is that 100 bucks for pay and spray? That's to be expected. I got your friend Jermaine where he wanted to go. Good, Nico. Thanks, thanks. Can't talk with you, sir. Okay, so... Roman needs more help again. Let's see what he wants. Jamaican Heat. Headed to town. I don't give a fuck if the bridge is busy. You're a cab driver. Hey. Hello, Roman Bellic Enterprises. Uh, no, uh, Mr. Bellic is stepped away from his office. Can I take a message? Okay, great. No, I'm not gay. Yes. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'll tell him. <laughs> Car 7, head to South Slopes. Come on, where are you, Mohammed? Hello, Roman Bellic's office. <sighs> Shit, fucking battery. This is... Chaos. Don't you have a charge or anything? Capitalism is a dirty business. Yeah? Like war? Hey, some people don't like that statement. Not exactly. Just saying. No, maybe not. When you're going to tell me properly about what happened? I'm not going to judge you. Uh, when you got time. There, I have time. Another time. Can I help? Okay, yes. Go pick up my friend little Jacob. He's a good man. Likes to smoke a bit. Look after him. He's on Oneida Avenue in South Slopes. Nico, man, we should talk sometime. Oh, I'm a good listener. Whatever, man. This bear be <laughs> not... <laughs> oh, Miss Weinstock. No, no, not you. Man, this dude uh, what just... What can I do for you today? He's acting all nice to just the, the clients and, like, the women, whatever. And, and he's just all mean towards his, his uh, employees. Well, typical employer. This better not be a fighting mission, River. Like, cause my health is already half, halfway. Like, I should have saved before doing this. If it is, oh well, it is what it is. Let's just go see what Roman wants. See. <laughs> Oops! Oh my gosh, bro! I thought he was gonna die for a second. Bro, my, my fault, dude. My fault, little Jacob. All right, brother. Follow that Dillon Street in Shotlock. Oh, he's Jamaican. Nice. <laughs> so, Yo, Nico. The one man Roman been talking about all this time. Cousin Nico. Gonna help Roman take over the world and thing. I guess so. Respect. All right, all right. We're going to this spot where I needed to wait for it. See? I got to ask you another favor to me. Don't fool. Can you take this piece? You hear anything bad going down? You come and help, right? Are you worried about this? I know how to use a gun if you want me to keep watch on things. Realness, brother. 
Yeah, my man, Roman's cousin. Thanks, respect. This rascal that I rock is with my brethren, real bad man the other day. I want to make peace, but John, what type of shit they might pull off? Bro, Jacob, what are you doing? All right, so we gotta pull out our piece and stand right here. All right, see what Jacob's, little Jacob is doing. Wait for little Jacob to get into his position. What's this? I know there's only gonna be one of you who's coming. Jacob, Jacob, Jacob. We have to teach a bad man his lesson and team. Oh, uh, a guy. Shit, Nico, get the blood class. Easy. Brother, that Red Dead Redemption low key might have improved my aim. Press R to reload. I already did. Oh, shoot. You did. Ooh. Sorry for Marga Dog. Marga Dog, turn around, bite you. Come here back at home, bro, can we? Get little Jacob back to the cafe. Bet. Hold the on. real creation step on Nico. Righteous with that piece. I have had much experience. I think we can do some work together, Auntie. In the future, you know? I am always looking for work. If it pays. Here's my number. Make we link up soon. Bro, I, I like little Jacob. <laughs> The aiming system's like pretty easy to follow. I don't know if it's just me or it's that I've been playing like a lot of Red Dead Redemption 2 off screen and that's kind of improved my aim. Thanks for everything. You can keep the pace. I think you know if you use it better than I and I do. One look. Mmm. Thanks. Thanks, hey, little Jacob. And I need for talk. Make we do it. I don't know what that means. I, I, don't, I don't speak Jamaican patois. From. I took Jacob where he wanted to go. Driving for you ain't as boring as I thought it would be. Jacob is a good man. Watching glue dry with Jacob would not be boring. Thank you, cousin. Ah, Roman's feeling fe feeling it too. Like he basically said the same thing because he's Jacob's a cool guy. I should probably. All right, let, let let's try to save and try to bring our health back up because. I, don't, I feel like if we don't, then we're kind of screwed. But yeah, like GTA 4 already has a way completely different feeling from GTA 5. It's like, I feel like GTA 5 is, who is this? Yoko, fed you Roman's cousin. Man, this dumbass dude, Vlad. Flat. Uh, name doesn't trigger the bells, I'm sorry. You better start remembering the important people, you dumb peasant. Your cousin owes me a lot of money. If you don't want to make things real difficult for him, you are going to come to Cameron's bar in Mohawk. I have a word for you. Well, yeah, um, yeah, GTA 5, it's like way more energetic. I don't know if that's the right word. Like, it's like more active, energetic, just open, open to just being funny, but knows when to be serious. GTA 4 feels like it's like the, the tones are like a lot more subtle. It's like you can tell that it's gonna be very much more serious than it is going to be humorous. It's like it's a game that's like trying to tell you tell us an actual story. Yo Nico, walk one. All right, you know, getting by. Yo, we need to help with something, you know? Will you come on my place at Dylan Street? Sure, I was looking to branch out a bit anyway. I'll see you soon. Nico, now that you settled into life in Liberty City, I was wondering if you could start to help your cousin with the family business. I thought all I'd been doing since I got there was helping you out. <laughs> right? You have, you have, but I mean officially. I need more drivers for the cab company. I'll pay you properly. 
Okay, then. Just call me whenever you want to take a fare. You can do as many as you like, Nico. There are always more customers. <sighs> That's probably something I won't be doing. Like, at least while I'm recording. I'll, I'll probably do it off cam. Maybe there's like a little reward to it, or maybe there's just nothing else besides earning a little bit of money. But since this this dude Vlad, man, this ugly ass dude, this jacked up vertex hairline. <laughs> yeah. So since Vlad's mission's nearby, um, let, let's just do his first. Bull in a china shop. Ah, fuck you. You're a bunch of pussies and fags. Nice. I'm going back to the meeting. Good. I'm going to be somebody. Yeah, yeah. See you later, Mel. You always He'd get canceled today. Hey, watch where you're going. Hey. Hey. I tried to tell you. Fuck to do you. It. Excuse me. Позвони мне когда заходишь, хорошо? Simon, I see you later, okay? Yoko, Fetterman's cousin. <laughs> What's your name again? Big mouth prick. Very cautious. Sit down. Cousin. Uh, Nico. That's it, Nico. Not Big Mouth Prick. You funny guy. I try. Yes, and this one's. I'll let you take the shit out of me. Take the shit? Yeah, yes, what, what, what does that up. mean? I don't understand. Ah, people who fuck with me get fucked with. Okay, fine. Calm down. Whatever. Some old man not This dude really months, expected us to I'm understand that. a person who is treated this way. Old bastard owns a china shop in the Camden Avenue in Dukes. Here you go. Don't hurt him. Just teach him a lesson. I don't need a bat to teach a lesson. Okay, so... So we're just... Me too. See you later. We're just intimidating a guy because he's not paying? Sounds simple enough. Oh, it's E to... To catch it, call a cab. Bro, I'm, I'm dumb, bro. I, I should have, I should have okay. been expected that. Like E is like the go-to for like a use button. I, I'm trying to remember. I'm trying to think like what is if there's any like stuff that GTA 4 has done better from what I've been playing. I, d I can't think of anything yet, Mike, but I mean, graphics, obviously GTA 5 has it because it's a way newer game. But GTA 4, I don't know, maybe... I'm, I, I got, yeah. Uh, what am I saying? Just I, I just have to play through a little bit more just to decide that for myself. Man, what, what is that guy doing? Bro, drive away, drive away. Oh, there's the China. My, my fault, my fault. I did not mean to do that. All right, let's park here. See what, see what they want. Hey, let me in. You have Vlad protection money, old man. Big Vlad and his protection money? I so scared. What I need protection from? You think this door is going to save your shop? There's shit I can break out here. Vlad should pay me to tell punks like you to go away. He get no money. He, that he does not. I'm not trying to be racist or anything. But like he does. That's that's not an Asian. That's not like an Asian accent at all. Uh, maybe maybe he's been there, been in America for a while, and and his English improved or whatever. But so I, I think based on the sign I saw, he's like a Korean guy. And this this guy borrowed money from the wrong person, and we're going to. Ooh, I can throw. Ooh, I can throw bricks into places. Why why can't I do that in GTA 5? Stop it, shit brain! I pay up now. I pay up. Here's your money. I hope you and Vlad choke on it. Sure, whatever. All right. That was easy. Thought the cops were gonna go on us, or I thought he was gonna resist. I just broke break a window, and now he just pays up. Man, we gotta do something, man. Vlad is just exploiting these people for no reason. 
I mean, is it is it their fault because they're borrowing money from him of all people? I don't know. Do they not have a choice anywhere else? Oh my! I, bro, the handling is like really heavy. It's like GTA 5 is like more arcadey. It feels like every vehicle is like light enough to like control just like simple simple enough but like gt4's handling is a lot more challenging i don't know if i'm not gonna say it's like realistic or anything i mean it, i guess between this and gta 5 it's this one's more realistic but at the same time it's like way too heavy like every car feels like it weighs a billion pounds hey yokel you managed to do the job get vlad his money he paid up i had to smash the shop up pretty good but he paid don't worry your little peasant head about it. Stupid jerk made a mistake of telling me how much he gets that shit for back east. He's the biggest crook in the neighborhood. Lucky I don't tell his customers what they're paying for. That it? Can I go now? Sure. Get out of my face. All this talk about me being the yokel, but your money can't buy a new hairline? Like you can't buy any more hair growth for your bald ass head? Get him out of here. I'm gonna go meet up with Jacob now. Hey, Co, how you doing? This is so much fun. You know, Roman, I haven't been having that much fun since I got here. It's been a lot like hard work. Well, you should hang out with your cousin more often. Maybe that is the problem. <laughs> Well, we're sitting here and calling the cops and watching them show up and look around. They're fucking stuffing bastards. You shouldn't cry wolf, Mama. Who knows when you really need help? Fuck! I think they see us. Man, who are you hiding? Are you hiding from Vlad again, Roman? Damn. It's Nico. Nico? Yeah, I'm a bleach hard last night, you know. The so called bleach. What? Uh, what up, Nico? Hey. Go out for see the man, you know. Go to my man, Roman. Roman? Yeah. He's okay. Yeah. No, he's not. He, this dude is hiding from Vlad. Big break. Sure. I promise I'll come for to our food, you know, Nico. A boy for creep before him can walk, you know. Yeah. Anyway, let's go for elephant drive. Come. Yo, I have a deal for me, you know. I have to go down to Saratoga Avenue in Willis. You mind taking this way? This herb don't do too well for my honor, my eye coordination. Damn, this, this dude is just smoking whatever. What a guy. I'm sure not... you don't want some? I'm sure. You might not keep the windows closed. Keep the gun down in the car. Hot box, see? So what's the deal? I'm buying some color off a new sauce, you know? Don't know if it's all this herb, but I made a parent that I don't trust them. Because oh, you're smoking, bro. Some harbor shots in the crew. Bad man know them a long time, but I think them faced it. And if this goes wrong, what kind of shit bad my going to lay upon them doing, you know? You think this is a setup? I don't know. I've been smoking hard, you know. It fucks with my brain and everything. Let me think all type of shit. I dread you don't trust yourself, can't trust no one else, see? You can't shake no hands when your fist be clinched. You hear me, brother? Sure, I hear you. Man, this dude need... How much is this guy smoking, bro? Dude's getting all paranoid and everything. I don't. Uh, I mean, I, I, have, I have no point opinion on like legalization, river, but I don't really condone it either. We're on a back in case one of them try to get jumped and run off with the ganja. Keep out of this vehicle. We might need to get out of here quick. Of course, the Jamaican one has to be smoking weed. Sure. 
Didn't have no stuff in her that tried to take my guy. I still got it though. Finish them if them try to come out the back. I got the front covered. Dang. Everything cross virgin run, yeah? Yo, one, one, get down. I'm gonna just drive into them. Happy birthday! Merry Christmas. Happy happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> that that's so random, bro. I don't know why I said that. Give me your money. Give me your ammo. Thank you. I like how the Bro, just move the body. Hey, I'm dying here. Can we go, please? Bro, the cop, just just move. Why aren't you doing anything about me? Like, I thought you were gonna go after me. You just saw me run o run into them just now. <laughs> the hell? I got them. You're a real bad man in a Nico. Respect. Follow us about the army in a middle spot. That was bark. Man, I, I like little Jacob missions already. Like, you're a bad boy, Nico. I don't know what I would be doing without you. But I got to get the blood class to set I up. Alright. Die while I block up some more in a brother. Rascal, I think you can call a bad man. You're a fool. It's a dead fool. And the boy has no match for I and I. It's nothing. Pause? What, what, wait, what does that mean? Here we be. Are you with me, brother? Yes. I gonna put some road boy in the ground. Doesn't mean what I think it means, but come on. All right, you ready? I gonna set this place on fire to blood clot. Oh, we're shooting up another place. <laughs> My bad. We can't get the shot on the boy. Get the window. You see him up there? This dude's just shooting. This dude's just shooting right here for no reason. All right. Wait, hold on. There we go. Come on. Oh. Man, easy. No problems. Man, light this place up. First aid kits will replenish your health. Okay. Break it! You see it? And I get them all. Yo, make we broke out there. I think some more soon turn. I didn't even take any damage through that. Interesting. Hold on, do it. is there did anyone like drop any valuable weapons or anything? Am I missing anything? Guess not. All right. You did good, little Jacob. So did I. Let's go back. Is there a celebrity blocking traffic? Chop! <gasps> them too late to stop by and I. Bring us back to the cafe and thing. Real bad man gonna be happy with this and thing. Janua. Thank you, my brother. Hey, no, no mention. It was yeah, a no pleasure. problem. I look out for bad man like how you look out for raw man. He's my cousin. Blood be the thickest man there is, you know? Light is not always an easy thing in a star. But man tell me, say, yo, Jacob, kill him. Jacob, show that, etc., etc. In always logical, but I and I follow. See? That idea? Of course, tell man for giving a school face. Orders are sometimes hard. You must be sure you agree before you follow. I have made that mistake myself a long time ago. For real. I know you're right, you know, brother. But Batman is my brother. I follow him wherever. Okay, so so little Jacob got this guy named Batman. Batman. Something I say, yo, we appreciate your assistance. See, we talk to you soon. Hey, don't don't kill me for that. It's, I know it's pronounced Batman, not Batman. We're going to need more guns. Move, Oscar. 
$200? Not bad. Let's see what Vlad wants us to do. May actually, yeah. I'll, so I'll, I'll just go to this one Vlad mission and I'll just quit the game. Let's see what he wants us to do. Well, Kriko, as you are my cousin, I want you to use family business how you like. Anytime you want cab, you call. Thank you, cousin. That could be very useful in this city. I can use his ability for car service. So just getting a taxi. Wait, what? What is this symbol? What is that? Fuck your mother, buddy. Is that? Hold on, who is who the, who the hell is this guy? Bullshit. What do you want? How you doing? Okay. How you doing? That's nice. That's real nice. That's real nice. Hey, I remember you. You're the comrade guy, the guy with all the jokes. Oh, yeah. How time flies when you're having fun. Right. And you're definitely having a lot all of fun. All alone, just smoking? No doubt. Not sure about that. Dude, you want to make a quick buck? <clears throat> Come with me. I got something to show you. We need a car or something. Fortunately, we got one right here. So I got you. This guy better not set me up. I'm gonna be Take pissed. Take me over to Masterson Street. Come on. I don't think someone that just smokes like smokes a lot, whatever, has the guts to do all this, right? So what are you showing, dude? This is meant to be the biggest rock in the world. These guys are fucking scientists. Things meant to be bigger than my fist, bigger than a melon. Fucking genius. Gonna last me weeks. Very specific sure comparisons. Getting more was fierce, dude. Like being on the trading floor. Yeah. Ha. Wait here while I make the deal, dude. Let's hope this thing isn't too heavy for me to carry by myself. Sick. Yo, Mr. Bankerman. This is a real sound investment you make. Dude, take me over to Wappinger and Harden. I don't- I already forgot what this guy was trying to do. But I'll just do what he says. Did you get it? Yeah, but this ain't no rock. It's a fucking boulder! This shit's gonna blast me to the moon! So what's that film where that guy is on a mountain and he gets chased by that huge uh, boulder? I don't know. Indiana oh, Jones. Shit, dude, I should remember this. Anyway, that's how I'm gonna feel when this shit's chasing me around my head? Well, I guess they can't really say it in this game because of copyright or trademark. This your place? Yeah, sort of. No, it doesn't matter. Here's some dollar. Appreciate the ride. How much are you giving me? 200? Dang, he, he gave me a lot just for one ride. Alright. Actually, I'm gonna go to Vlad's place, see what he's up to. And then I'll end the video. You're going to have your license revoked. What? My friend, smoking in a bar is a crime. Plain and simple. Wait, you joking, right? Who is this it's nerd, joke. bro? You're, you're playing hey, a joke on me. Mallory, I, I can tell Fedek his cousin is okay. He just walked in. Great girl. Yeah? Stay away from her. Yeah, of course. Yeah, you're a creep, no, listen, bro. You did good with the business the other day. But now one more peasant is trying to avoid pain. Who? Moskovsky jerk who owns the laundry in the Masterson Street. Thinks in this country business is done differently. Says he will call cops on us. Okay. So, a Moskovsky? Jerk needs to be taught a lesson. Give him a beating. Let him know might is right. Hey! Stop that smoking back there! First rule! Easy, Wait. buddy. Go on. Do what you're gonna do. Oh, he's but a health remember, inspector? You, up, you don't know me. I see Why do you sound like a I nerd, though? Ho, ho. Hello. Vlad говорит. Да, да. Что ты хочешь? Быстрее. Я очень занят. So, Roman has no money to pay back to Vlad, and now we gotta do all of Vlad's dirty work. Me 
you go. You can't just let him boss around like 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 you. You can't just let him boss around. You like this man? Come on. I have a message from Vlad. Shit! Stay away from me. Oh my gosh, bro, get over here. Are you dead ass? Bro, get- bro, he's about to get away. Why did you set me up like this, dude? Oh, so we just, we just gotta ram his car? Fair enough. Bro, I would've been so mad if I got a mission failed. Hey, go fuck, alright? I'll ram you off the road! Okay, you want me to ram you? I'll ram you off the road! Fortunately, our car is way faster than his van, so this should not be an issue. Let's go. Easy, light work. You got me. You got me, okay? Why have you not paid Vlad the money you owe him? I'm going to. I've just been having the trouble getting it together. Vlad is an impatient man. You will be getting the money to him soon, or your wife shall be using your washing machines to get the blood out of your clothes. Do you understand? I do not ask twice for a favor. I understand. I will get it to him. I thought this country was different. <laughs> Typical American dreamers and all that, man. I spoke to the laundry metal. He gets the message. He will pay you now. I like your style. You can be an intimidating guy. It's a shame everybody knows what a stupid yokel you are when this you're still so talking about ah, yokel, 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 bro. Hey, Stop calling me broke, man. Like, if you're so rich compared to me, then, then why don't you use that money to get some better hair? Like, get a toupee or something. Forgive me. Sorry. Your money's mine, though. I think that's it for today. Uh, thank you guys for watching my videos. I know I haven't been uploading a lot, but for those that are patient enough to, like, stay and watch my videos right now, to this day, like, I, I thank you guys so much. Like, I really appreciate it. You know, I, I've just got a lot of things I'm, I've been focusing on besides my YouTube channel. So I hope you guys understand that. Let me know if you want to see more GTA 4 videos or just comment down any kind of videos that you want me to make. I will go read the comments and see if I want to do them or not. And I'm Terminal and I will go see you next time. Bye!